training is derived from Professor Moses Powell uh, and, and many of his students, uh, one of which being Soke Little John Davis. Uh, the, the system is, is designed, as Professor would say, as for an urban type of fighting. The urban, uh, the urban uh, contact that may happen is, is the type of thing that we're dealing with because most fights are gonna, going to happen in the urban area. Uh, it's, it's, you know, Professor would probably say, you know, punch, kick, sweep, stomp, us, you know, and that's, that's a, a total <laughs> development of what this is all about. But basically what we're dealing with is being able to teach a person from the martial arts area how to defend himself by uh, diverting someone's attention, diverting someone's energy and someone's force. Uh, we would apply locks, we would, we would sweep them, we would throw them. There's no situation that we would end up with them uh, staying uh, in, a, in a perpendicular, standing up. They would finish on the ground and we would be the vector of a situation. Uh, uh, what we do first is we find out where that student is. We have uh, students that come in from other systems. We have students that have never trained or done any type of physical calisthenics in their life. So we first div uh, div find out where they are and from that point we work on. Uh, we bring everyone into our system uh, pretty much the same, such as we teach them the basic rolling, we teach them the falling, uh, we teach them how to stand once we show them how to fall, how to stand and how to move. We teach them how to block and then counter with a punch. Uh, those are things that we do uh, for, for basic students. The, the, the most important thing to remember in coming into our system, uh, or into any system of martial arts, is that um, you will get what you put into it. Uh, it's not necessary to be able to lift a thousand pounds. The only thing that's necessary to be able to d redirect and change someone's direction with a joint. Uh, we deal a lot in joints, see, because we're not dealing with muscle, muscles, we're dealing with, with joint areas. Most martial arts is basic physics, especially in Jiu Jitsu and in forms of Aikido and, and that type of thing. Whereas what we would do is, let's, for instance, someone is punching at, at me. They're looking for the, they see a target, they're attempting to hit the target. What, what I would do is I would move the target uh, at a time when they're not expecting it to, to happen. They would then, uh, their motion and force would be directed forward away from me. I would then change that direction and send them in the opposite, which would cause a, a, a natural flow of their body because of their own weight being rediverted. Um, the martial arts, and particularly the system that I study under Professor Moses Powell and Soki Little John Davis is, is a system that is really designed to develop your phil the philosophy portion. You know, there's a, there's a lot of philosophy, there's a lot of your mental, uh, your mental and spiritual capabilities that has to, has to uh, that takes a serious part in this. Um, most people think that it's just about punching and kicking. It's not about that. It's about knowing within yourself that you can do whatever you desire and that you can change any situation or circumstance that comes in front of you. So um, uh, uh, we always say that martial arts is only 10%. The physical part is only 10%. The mental and the spiritual takes up 90% 90, 90 of, of our time. We train here in, at When Worlds Collide, Center of the Arts.